Oh, I hate that the camera is horizontal. We're not going to stress about it. We're going to take a deep breath and move on. Hi, everybody. Welcome to my first YouTube video. I feel so much stress in my bones because of this. However, I hope you enjoy this monstrosity playing out in front of you. Yes, welcome to my YouTube channel. I got so many ideas in this little brain of mine that I can't compose them into 30 second or one minute videos that you see on my TikTok or Instagram. All of those ideas will be on this channel. So if you would like to stay updated, see more videos like this, Click subscribe. Why not? It'll be fun. We'll do it together. Click. But yes, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to be showing you how I do this crazy hair of mine right here. And I'll give you a little bit more insight on what kind of haircut I have, how, what to ask your stylist for when you go in to get a haircut similar to mine, what hair dye I use. I actually use these products to color my hair. I just had an Emily moment and forgot. Sorry how to style it, what products I use, the whole shebang. Before we get started, I'm gonna do a little outfit of the day for you because I know that plenty of people are going to be asking me in the comments. So, I got this beautiful makeup going on, very simplistic. I have this vintage 70s blouse with this beautiful embroidery on it. You can check that out right there. I have a tiger eye beaded I have this skirt. It's also vintage 70s. I'm on a stool. Bear with me, I'm so tiny. Got it on Poshmark. And then we have my beautiful, cherished Jeffrey Campbell's in the LED EMB. So I have plenty of ideas coming up within the next few weeks on this channel, but let's just get into the video because I could talk for years. Hey besties, it's later in the evening and I just showered. So we're gonna get down to business. This is how I do my heatless curls. To start off, I have a shag haircut. And when I initially did my heatless curl method with the scarf curls, I said, I have a shag haircut. And I said that with confidence. Everybody read me to filth in the comments saying, you don't have a shag haircut, that's just layers. And so I said, you know what? You're right. And you know what I did? I went out and I got a proper shag haircut. So now I can say with confidence that I have a shag. So my hair is damp because I just took a shower. You don't need to have clean hair to do this. This has to be a little bit damp for the curls to hold better. Then I use some leave-in conditioner. This is the Not Your Mother's Way to Grow leave-in conditioner. Probably not the best, but what do I know about hair? If you have a better leave-in conditioner that you swear by, let me know, please. So we just spritz this all over the hair. You don't want to put too much because then your hair will be greasy. And then brush it through. All right, so now comes the fun part. You're gonna need foam rollers, which don't use Velcro rollers, they're balls. They really damage your hair if you don't use them correctly. And I'm not saying you can't use them for anything, just not for this particular tutorial. So you're gonna take the top section of your hair and you're gonna be doing two seconds. So one roll here and one roll behind it. Depending on if you have bangs or not, you can decide where you position the first roller on the top of your head. But I'm just leaving a little bit of space and rolling the hair towards my face. Rolling it towards your face, it gives me, it frames it better. It frames my face because I have a very angular square face. And then I'm just gonna do one right behind it with about the same amount of hair. Once again, I don't know the exact amount of hair that I'm putting in my hand, it just feels right. So once again, brushing up, taking the roller, twisting it towards my face, and then securing. So you have one, two. Then you're gonna move to either side. Taking a piece from the side because we are again gonna do two rollers. We're gonna do the same exact thing. Roll towards my face. And do the same thing 
right behind. Okay, so as you can see, we have one, two rollers on each side of the head, and two on top as well. Now you have this back hair left over. You're gonna take a section in the back, and you can kind of feel where that section's gonna be. It's gonna be right smack in the middle. And you're just gonna, once again, curl towards the face. After that, you're left with these two little strands. You can either roll them together or roll them separate. I'm just gonna roll them separate. Just to double check the setup we got going on here, you're gonna have two rollers on top, two on each side. You're gonna have one in the middle of the back and two on the bottom of the sides. To comfortably sleep with this mess we got going on, uh, we got a beanie. It actually makes it super comfortable to sleep with and we're just gonna cover it. You could use like a silk, silk scarf probably. That would be healthier for your hair, but my dumbass said beanie. It is the next morning. I'm all ready for the day. And this is the next step in the curling method where you take everything out. So you're just gonna pull the beanie off or whatever you have covering your curls. My bangs look crusty as ever, but we live. We're gonna take all these rollers out. You don't really need much of a technique to do this. Just take them out. I'm going for a little bit of a looser curl today. Spoiler alert, I lied. These come out ridiculously tight. Okay, proceed. When you're done taking all the rollers out, you should look kind of nuts. Um, a little bit poopy, if you will. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and brush everything out. As you can see, I still look kind of nuts though because my bangs aren't done. But I'm gonna take you guys in the bathroom with me because that's where my curling iron is heating up and we'll finish it there. Pardon the horrendous lighting. However, I'm in my bathroom now and I'm gonna show you how I do my bangs. So I use a one inch curling iron. Since I have a middle part, I'm just gonna take my little comb, make sure that's defined. And I'm gonna take little bits of hair. So as you can see, and I'm just going to curl them like that. I'm just gonna hold it down for a few seconds and then let go. And they should go that way. I'm gonna repeat that again with another little section of hair. this section of bangs and actually curl them towards my face. I'm gonna do that same exact thing to the other side and then I'll show you the rest. So after that's all curled, I'm gonna take my round brush and just brush it away from my face. So the results will always kind of vary with this hairstyle. Like today I have a lot on top and the curls are a little bit tighter than I necessarily want. See, I literally told you guys, I look like Miss Annie. Hey besties, it's later in the evenings from when I finished my hair tutorial, but I wanted to show you what it kind of fades into. And if you wanted to do a lighter curl, you can definitely wrap them looser or don't dampen your hair before wrapping them in the foam rollers. But this is also very well achievable. And yeah, it looks cute as well, so. But it really just takes a lot of playing around with it to figure out what works for you. So the final thing I do is I set with like, just like a little bit of hairspray. This definitely isn't the best hairspray on the market, but it works for me. And I'll show you a little hairspray tip that my mom taught me, which everybody probably already knows about. I'm just dense. 
But when you're going for really voluminous hair, what you can do is you can sort of hold your hair up and spray while it's up there. Hold it for a few seconds and it'll automatically give you a lot more volume. I commend you all for making it to the end of the video. Thank you all for watching. I have a lot more ideas coming. So, you know what? Hit subscribe. We'll do it together. I hope the tutorial was relatively easy to follow, and I hope you guys enjoy my kind of poofy personality, and you're gonna be seeing a lot more of it soon. So, buckle up, bitches! I love you guys! Stay magical!